Hey folks. So today we're gonna actually use Google Calendar to create a calendar invite for a student and not give them access to a actual Google Meeting link, but give them access to a Google Meeting nickname. And the nickname gives you as the educator a lot more protection from students going back into a group later on or receiving a recording if um, if you decide to record a session. So I am going to click on the create option. And when I do that, it's going to give me the option to put in a calendar invite. I'm going to make this calendar invite for three o'clock today. And I am going to click on the more options. When I do that, you'll see that I get the option to, you know, fill out my calendar invite. So I'm going to do call this test call using the names. And I am going to, um, I want to make sure that I don't have a Google video meet on. And if I do, if it happens to do that automatically, all I want to do is click on the little X here and remove that. I'm going to add the student. I have a student that I use as a task called Fluency Tutor Test. I'm going to add them to the call. And then I'm going to add a nickname here with a, a, a URL or a nickname URL so that that shows up in the student's um, uh, email when they get the invitation. So I'm simply going to type in g.co slash meet slash and now I'm going to give it the nickname name that I want to use. So this is for Fluency Tutor. So I'm going to call this um, Fluency Tutor. And it puts in that, that nickname for my Google Meet right here. So all of that is just right in there. I click save and I can send it to the student and they're going to get the email request for the invitation. And when I click on the actual email or the calendar invitation, notice that it actually does have a link here. And this is the link to my Google Meet um, meeting with the nickname Fluency Tutor. Any questions, please feel free to contact me and we can jump into a meeting to discuss.